For the past eight cycles, fans have been watching recaps of America's Next Top Model every week from Pat and Carolyn, and now they're bringing them back for an all-star recap. You remember Pat and Carolyn from cycles like Cycle 9, Cycle 10, Cycle 11, Cycle 12, The Petite Cycle 13, Cycle 14, Cycle 15, Cycle 16, okay, you get it. And now Pat and Carolyn are coming back with an all-star recaps for the all-star cycle of America's Next Top Model. As you can see, for this all-star recap, we spared no expense on our opening credits. Just like Tyra did. Just like Tyra did. Hey guys, it's Pat. And Carolyn. We're back with recaps of America's Next Top Model, Cycle 17, the all-star cycle, rocking our sweet video iPad amazing all-star recaps. <laughs> Exactly. Carolyn, any other way. what did you think of All Stars I'm, so I'm far? Pretty, I'm pretty stoked about it. I love that we don't have to get to know new characters. It's like we know these people. Mm -hmm. It's kind of fun to see also how much, well, a lot of them haven't changed that much, but just to see what they look like and... I don't know. It's I, I'm really excited about it. Yeah, I was saying when I was watching, I'm really glad that I just know them. And when they were all coming into their house one by one, I was like, I already knew who all the girls were, but I was like, Isis, Sheena, like, just. Oh, Sheena! Uh, I knew you'd be excited about Sheena. Sheena for president. Um, so very quickly, if you didn't see the episode, the girls moved into this giant mansion. They all sort of. Came in one by one. We got to hear what they kind of thought about each other. Um, and then Mr. J came in to tell them that they were going to do a photo shoot right in their backyard where they were representing, what was it? The like their, their old style, who they were when they originally tried it out, basically. Yes. It was, the photo shoot itself was a little janky, I have to admit. Yeah. For all I stars. Really, I don't really like it. You know what, though? You know who I thought looked the most beautiful ever? Well, okay. Bianca, even with that red hair, so beautiful. She looked, she looked beautiful, and I actually, I really love Shannon's outfit. I don't love Shannon, and I don't. I think she. I'm gonna go ahead and say this, and everybody's gonna get pissed. I think she looked old. She's probably younger she's, than me. She's younger than both of us. Is she? Yes, I think okay, she's well, like she 26. Looked she looked old compared to the young ones, mm -hmm. and um, but I like. I loved her outfit, like with. The even with those swim trunks and not underpants. <laughs> that was just ridiculous. How about Nicki Minaj being like, do they look like underpants to you? She... I, know, I love Nicki. By the way, Nicki Minaj was using different accents. That's right. Are you or am I making, like, losing my mind? Um, I think she had she the thing cut out for a second. You said she has different accents. I think she suffers maybe from Tyra syndrome a little bit, where suddenly she is speaking with an accent that is not hers. But... I thought she did a pretty good job as a guest judge. Yeah, she had a British accent. Yeah, she did a great. Job. She was having a good time. Um, so, any of the girls look completely different to you? I know Kayla got rid of her red hair, has the dark black hair. You know, Laura looked. She just looked really thin to me. Mhm. Mm they all kind of. You can tell they all got a little like. Oh, I'm a real model now. I have to like no food for me. Yeah, I thought that. Um, I thought that Angela. Uh, Angeli. Anjali, I thought she looked really good, and I thought that, um, ooh, somebody else I was going to say that I thought looked really good, but I didn't Did you like Bree's, did you like Bree's short hair? No. No? Sure. Neither did Nicki Minaj. Yeah, I know, me and Nicki, we were like, oh, right on there. Gosh, who did, who am I forgetting? Oh, uh, there's a lot of people. Alexandria. Uh, oh, Dominique. Oh. She looked beautiful, and her picture... Honestly, I would have picked it as the best picture. I thought she looked great. Yeah, I thought it was good. Okay. I I mean, let's talk about the runway show. There's kind of too many girls to talk about all, uh, all together. But Alexandria, who is fun to say that you hate her, and she's the villain, and I agree, but she's a really good character. She got booed at Don't the live event. I'm so sorry for her. Who, who boos people? Oh, people boo. You oh. know we'd be booing. Oh, people boo. I know, I hate people, but I wouldn't. I wouldn't boo anyone from Top Model. Well, I don't think I would call Maybe Ancho Cat. Yeah. But she, Just I kidding. feel really, really, really bad for her. I actually think she's kind of pretty. She does have a little bit of, like, dopey eyes. She like, looks like a rug rat. Like Rug Rats, the uh -huh. TV show. Yeah, she kind of... <laughs> True, it's a fact, everybody. 
That's pretty great. Um, but I can't believe she got booed. And but I want to give a shout out to um, the fans of a blog about things on our YouTube channel who went to that live event and took pictures and sent them to us. Thank you, and I hope you got to see yourself on TV. We totally yeah, saw you. That would be fun. Oh, can we I talk about? Please, can we talk about two other things? Of course. The wild people, like Lisa and Brittany. Yes. I'm totally over them. Like you, that's like so old school reality show that I can't even take them seriously because it's just all about the character. Mm. I'm sort of really over that. Let's talk about panel, shall we? Sure. I guess we have to. Fourteen girls remain. One will be eliminated. And first call out was Isis. I mean Isis. Yeah. I'm not surprised. Although I think it was a little rigged because Tyra just loves her. But, yes. I mean, she looks great. She has an amazing body. Yeah, I just don't think that she had the best photo. What okay. was she doing? She was, like, laying on uh, on her hands and knees. I don't know. Yeah. I Not my favorite. Um, Allison obviously got second. Everybody's in love with Allison. Camille, Lisa, and Anjali were in the top as well. The bottom, surprising, well, I figured Alexandria would be in the bottom just because she got booed. <laughs> yeah. You all right? You choking? Are you surprised and Brittany was in the bottom, too. I kind of was, because I didn't think her picture was bad, and I didn't think she... I thought people liked her, but the person who got eliminated was Brittany, which I thought was a surprise. But I also, I don't know who else I would have thought would get eliminated first when it's All-Stars. Lisa. Lisa? Yeah. I think she's too crazy to get rid of her. Crazier yeah. than Brittany. Who do you think is going to win? This is very tough. Because I'm trying to think of the prizes that are involved. Prizes are a Spread in Vogue magazine, a CoverGirl contract, a correspondent gig with Extra, which is the tricky one, and then something else that I can't remember. Uh, the clothing uh, Express. Express. Yes. So the, the Extra one is the one that's throwing me off because the person has to be able to speak really well and be good on TV, which I think some of the girls, I don't know if they could do that. So I feel like... Brie is going to win no. because of that. I think Bianca. I'm going Bianca. Okay, I can see that. Yeah, I kind of, she's got some personality and she is just beautiful. She really is Are they doing makeup? a looker. I think they are doing makeovers. I saw in the preview they had. Ashley Simpson is going to give them tie overs. At the very beginning she came running in. She was like, tie overs. Ashley Simpson. Yeah, Ashley Simpson needs a tie over, please. Her career needs a tie over. She needs a tie over. Um, okay, so I don't really have anything else to say. Do you? No, I think, I think we're good. I'm so excited we're back. Watch us every week. So excited. Oh, wait, really quick. Can we talk about how, you know, at the end of the show, when they're eliminated and they show the collage of girls and then one goes whoosh, and disappears? In the bathtub. What? And they put Alexandria on a motorcycle? In a pool. It's like a baby pool. Yeah, but it? Alexandria was on a motorcycle. Why? I didn't even see that part. I they snuck it in. Baby pool. They, there's a baby pool. There's a motorcycle. I don't understand. I don't, I don't understand, understand it. it. Oh man. They're so they're they are just cheap. They they just. Oh, I would have done the photoshopping for you. One one more thing. Yes. What about the fact that all those damn models were walking on water. Did Why did know? they do that? Well, they photoshopped them into know. that. Fake you. So I know. I agree. It's and also kind of looked like they were in the food court at the mall in their backyard. I don't know. We should have talked about this at first, but maybe uh, the, hopefully yeah. the the budget for photo shoots and photoshopping goes up in episode two. Ridiculous. Ugh, such a great time, Carol, to be here with you again. You too. We'll talk to everybody next week. Good to see you guys. See you next week. Leave some comments and look at the pictures on the blog about things.com and we'll see you then. Okay, bye. <laughs>